My name is Alejandro Diaz. I'm from Houston, Texas. I'm 21 years old, and I'm addicted to being the paper king. Being the paper king means dedicating yourself to living a flat life. Everything about you must be paper thin. Your outfits, your food, even your personality. As you can probably guess, I'm not too big of a fan being so th thick. I'm currently on step four on a nine step program that's going to help me transform into literal paper. And boy, that day cannot come soon enough. Have you ever played rock, paper, scissors? Let me give you a word of advice. Always bet on paper. You'll win every time, watch. All right. Rock, paper, scissors. See, I didn't win, but I didn't lose either, so I'm on this. Sometimes when the world gets a little too three-dimensional, I like to enter my own little escape. That escape is called Paper Mario. Nobody understand. They'll see one day. Paper will rule the world. <laughs> oh, Paper Mario, you're the only one that understands me. <gasps> Have you ever been invested in a show? A show that you've been watching for quite a long time, months even. You put in you put in the time, you put in the effort, you were invested in the characters, you followed their stories, you know what they've been through. And then you get to like the last season of the show or the last few episodes, and you just have that feeling of impending doom that the show is gonna end. Well, let me just put this into perspective. I've been playing Paper Mario for 21 years now, and yes, I'm just barely getting to the end of the game. I don't know what the next chapter of my life's gonna be. I don't know what I'm gonna do when it's all over. I'm thinking, if nothing else, I'm just gonna fold myself up and stick myself in a drawer, like all good Paper Kings. My family complained to me for years to go see a therapist or a psychiatrist and get some help. But I tell them every time, I will not go see a third dimensional psychiatrist. If there's a person out there that is a two dimensional person and they are a psychiatrist, I will gladly talk to them. But if you have a third dimension, you're just wasting my time. Come on, Mario, man. You gotta do it, man. He's too strong, man. That's a low blow, man.
You see my boy here? That's Colorado, dude. This guy right here? That's Colorado. He's pretty much my best friend, and he's always getting into some sort of trouble. <laughs> I love you, Colorado. <laughs> Colorado, you're such a freaking fool. He's my best friend, though. Well, guys, it's over. It's over. After 21 years of my life, I beat it. What am I going to do with my life now, dude? <laughs> Hey guys, it's been about a week since I've pretty much completed my purpose in life, and uh, I'm not going to lie to you guys, I was watching the credits on loop, I just don't know man, I've been, I've been thinking about a lot, and I think it's time that I moved on. Maybe it's time I added another dimension to my personality. I don't know, man. I just, I don't know what I'm gonna do without him. Paper Mario was everything to me. Yeah. I think it's time I start a new chapter in my life. Forget paper. What's this? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I will never stop being the paper king. The paper king is who I am. There is no one else. There is no Alejandro Diaz anymore. He's dead. It's only the paper king now. Now I just need to find my paper queen. <laughs>